Welcome back, troopers. This is DX Wiggins. We are on part 10, I believe. Part 10 of Knights of the Old Republic. Well, just last episode, we got out of the cantina in the lower city. We were about to go talk to this girl right here. Hey, what's up, girl? Hey, you can't just walk in here. This is the hidden back base. How do I know you're not a Vulcan spy sent to kill Gaddon? Uh, I need Gaddon's help. I was told to speak to him. A lot of people want to go inside and speak to Gaddon. He's a hero of the common folk. But the days of the Hidden Beck's open-door policy are gone. Between the Sith Conquest and the Vulcra Gang War, Gaddon has more enemies than he used to. We're being careful about who we let in now. Maybe a bribe could give me... No, that wouldn't be good. Maybe I could be an ally against all those enemies. Well, we do need all the help we can get. And you don't look like you're with the Vulcars or the Sith. Besides, it's not like you can do anything to harm Gaddon in the heart of his own base. Not with Zedra watching his back. So you're gonna let me in? Go in and speak to Gaddon if you want. Just remember to be on your best behavior. The hidden Vex are watching you. Okay. Well, that's reassuring. Let's go. Hold it right there. Who are you? And what is your business with Gaddon? Calm down, Zandra. Nobody's going to try anything here in the middle of our own base. It would be a suicide mission. You're too trusting, Gaddon. Brezhik and his Vulkers want you dead. Anyone we don't know is a potential threat, and it's my job to make sure you're safe. Do you want us to start attacking strangers on sight, Zerdra? Like the Vulkers do? I will never let it come to that. Now step aside and let them pass. As you wish. You can speak to Gaddon if you want, but I've got my eye on you. You try anything and you'll be vaporized before you can say Vulkar spy. What's up? You'll have to forgive Zerdra. Ever since Brejic and the Vulkars began this war against us, she's been a little overzealous in her security duties. The problems with the Sith haven't helped things. Zerdra seems to forget that I know how to look after myself. Now, how can I help you? Um... I need information on the Republic escape pods that crashed in the Undercity. The escape pods? You know, I heard the Sith have been asking around the Upper City about them as well. But you don't look like you're with the Sith. They might be spies, Gaddon. They might be working for the Sith. Calm down, Zerdra. If the Sith thought we knew anything useful, they'd have a battalion of troops kicking down our door. No, I think this offworlder has his own agenda. Don't worry. I'm not working for the Sith. I suppose I could tell you what I know. It's not like it could do any harm to me or my gang. But it might cause problems for the Vulcas. And that's okay in my book. The Vulcars stripped those pods clean within hours after they landed. It's too bad we didn't get there first, considering what my spies reported the Vulcars found. A female Republic officer named Bastila survived the crash. We Bex don't believe in intergalactic slavery, but the Vulcars aren't so picky. They took a prisoner. Bastila's a slave? What will happen to her now? Normally, the Vulcars would take a captured slave and sell them for a nice profit to Davik, or an off-world slaver. But a Republic officer is no ordinary catch. They still think Bastila is just a Republic officer. That could work to our advantage. Maybe she'll even figure out a way to escape from the Vulcar base on her own. She's too valuable to leave with the Vulcar scum at the base. Brezhik's probably got your Republic friend hidden away somewhere safe until the big swoop race. You'll never find her. Swoop race? What, do I have to, uh, what does that have to do with it? I'm afraid your friend has become a pawn in Brezhik's game to take over the lower city. He's offered her up as the Vulcar's share of the prize in the annual Swoop Gang race. By putting up such a valuable prize, Brezhik hopes to win the loyalty of some of the smaller gangs. Their numbers will allow him to finally destroy me and my followers. So how do you propose we go about rescuing Bastila then? Well, we can't fight all the gangs. The only hope you have of rescuing Bastila is to somehow win the big season opener of the Swoop race. Uh, can you help me with this? I might be able to help you with this. If you'd be willing to help us, we both have something to gain here, and much to lose. What are you proposing? The swoop race is for the lower city gangs only. I could sponsor you as a rider for the Hiddenbecks this year. If you win the race, you'll win your friend's freedom. But first, you have to do something for me. My mechanics have developed an accelerator for a swoop engine. A bike with the accelerator installed can beat any other swoop out there. But the Vulcars stole the prototype from us. They plan to use it to guarantee a victory in this year's swoop race. I need you to break into their base and steal it back. 
How am I supposed to get inside? Well, getting into the Volker base won't be easy. The front doors are locked tight. But I know someone who might be able to get you in the back way. Mission Veil. Vale. Mission? Gaddon, you can't be serious. She's just a kid. How is she supposed to help them with this? Mission's explored every step of every back alley in the lower city. Plus, she knows the undercity sewers better than anyone. If anyone can get inside the Vulcan base, it's her. Where can I find Mission? She and her Wookiee friend Zalbar are always looking to stir up a little excitement. They like to go exploring in the undercity, despite the dangers. Your best bet is to look for her in the undercity. But you'll need some way past the Sith guard post at the elevator. I've got that Sith Tripper uniform. A simple disguise might have worked on the upper city guard, but the security down here is much tougher. You'll need the proper papers to get past him. Luckily, my gang ambushed one of the Sith patrols headed down to the Undercity. They never made it, and their security papers fell into my hands. Since we're working together now, I suppose I could give them to you in exchange for your uniforms. With the security papers, you won't need a disguise anyway. But I like my disguise. I like to be prepared. Eventually, the Sith are going to try to drive us out of the Undercity. Sith disguises might give my people the edge we need in a crucial battle. Okay, I'll trade my uniforms. I can get my uniforms back anyway. Good choice. Cheating! Thanks for the uniforms. You won't need them with these security papers anyway. Now, is there anything else I can do for you? Um... Your questions. time would probably be better spent going after the prototype swoop engine the Vulcan... Yeah, um... I'll be back when I get the prototype. I suggest you hurry. The swoop race is coming up, and we want you to have time to practice before... Okay, okay, okay. Let's just explore the base a little. Locked. How are you guys doing? Is it safe out there on the street? Doesn't like folks take a shot at anybody. She is I can't believe that Trader Bresher used to be one of us. I'm sorry about that. I'm sorry to hear that. Control room. Oh man. Locked too. See the big picture. Oh, that's nice of you to say. The base is super small compared to the freaking uh, Volker base. Might as well get the that bounty from the guy in the this undercity apartment right here. Which way did I come from? Who are these guys? Ah, oh, more black vulcars afraid. Oh my! Hello! There's a lot of those guys. Okay. Uh we got a fight on our hands. Ready. Come on. Yes. We got this. Oh God. Fine. You want to fight? Is that it? Is that it? Where's my Where's my sword? Where the hell? Sith trimmer sword. Bring it on. How do you miss? Oh. Oh. <laughs> How'd you like that? You asked for this! Thanks. Fine, no remains. I don't need remains. Shoot. 
that I might I should probably get rid of Karth because if he sees it, he's gonna be mad. I'm gonna go into solo mode, thank you. Sure. Oh hey, hey Eli. Karth doesn't suspect a thing. Hey Matrix, what's up? Again. He doesn't like visitors. Oh well uh I think it's time for me to collect your bounty. You're going to have to earn it. God damn it. Kill him. Dang it, DX Wigan. We don't have time for you to mess around. Okay. How about this? How about this? How do you miss? Okay. Okay. We don't really got time for any of this. Um. Um. Heal! Heal! Yeah! Thank you! Thank you! God! Main. Thank you! <laughs> thank you, Eli! Where have you been? Oh, don't worry about that car. Then we gotta go turn it in. Turn it in. Hello, Zax. Um, got a bounty to collect on. Dead trade. 300 credits. How about 400? Yeah! Persuade works on him. Okay. I'll be going now. Alright, guys. Thanks for watching. I will be going to... What am I going to be doing next? Uh... Finding mission, I guess. <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to leave a like and a favor if you enjoyed, and subscribe to Come Trooper today. See you guys next time.